Hey friends, welcome back. Some more here bringing you some more Seven Days to Die Alpha 16. This is Experimental Build 112. This is our first restart. No more broken ankle. Lesson learned there. Grab yourself something delicious to drink. Join me. Let's get going. And we're back, friends. All right. So I got all of the beginning quests done. And I also took the time to generate the seed in the world viewer in the editing tool there. And I think we want to head this way. Though, if I remember right, if we get to the trader, that is a whole... Hey, wait. Interesting. So... It looks like it didn't want to give me my go find the trader quest. Is it anywhere on my compass? Ooh, that might be problematic, guys. It's not the end of the world, right? I could always go find it on the editing tool, which was really powerful. One thing I noticed, though, about the editing tool is uh, you don't have, like, a absolutely positive... Uh, bearing on oh there's the new feral boar that we're not going to go mess with just yet because we will get wrecked but actually you know what screw that uh, let's drop points in to weapon smithing let's make a better club and then let's see that'll take just a moment and this we can scrap we're gonna go tangle with that boar guys where's that let's not there it is right there see it just a, just above my crosshairs over there I want to go mess with that All right, and I also slid the field of view slider around, uh, so that way, I'm hoping that my melee game is is good as well. Uh, let's see. Also, I really, 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 really want to stress, guys, do not scrap your land claim block. Right? If we were to make like, you know, rules for seven days to die, as there are for zombie land, rule number one would be do not scrap your land claim block. Rule number two would be do not lose sight of what you're hunting because I just did that and that's no bueno. He's out there somewhere. I can smell him. There we go. So at least we have a slightly better... Oh, there he is. Okay, good. All right, guys. We're going to, like, speed crawl to him. All right. Now, earlier, I... Whoa, ho. That thing is huge. That's got to be a bear, right? Okay, here we go. Just kidding. Here we go now. Just kidding. Psych. That one. Oh my gosh, really? Okay, let's get closer. And if you guys have watched any of my series at all, you know this is very typical for me. An atrocious shot with the bow thing is huge it's like it's like a big brown boulder come on stupid pig ah oh there we go okay well here we thought that was going to be hard let's take him down not anger that bear you know what the very, very best thing about this world is no broken ankle. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so we can harvest something. Really hoping to get a bone so we can make a shiv. Of all the things that we killed and whacked apart uh, in the last world, we didn't get a bone. So I don't know if that's because I didn't take the corpses all the way down, but I think they just disappeared after we got through this. Okay. Then there's our bone. Okay, so we're going to back away without angering the bear because it's right over there. I don't know what they're... Like, I have enemies set to 30 seconds. I don't know what bears, you know, I don't know how they're going to act. Though I think Mafki... Ooh, that was nice. I think Mafki has actually taken a bear down. I need to watch that video. I don't know how he did it. Speaking of other content creators, guys, so the official forums has a whole 
Oh, I think that's the trader right there, actually. The official forums has a page uh, dedicated to content creators. So, oh my gosh, a hunting knife. Check that out. There's some coal. That's great. I'm just not too concerned about it right now. Um, and so make sure you go check that out. Hmm. Adrian would probably tell me how to kill that thing. Actually, he'd probably just say run. <laughs> And then I think the front door over here. And we are running. Let me tell you what. I'm hoping that thing's not faster than we are. Or that I don't turn the corner or run into something bad. Okay, so it was on this other side. Look at that distant POI. Look at how beautiful that is. Ow. Okay. So we are at least a little safe, folks. Aside from that guy. And the flag is, like, really throwing me off. Um, let's see. Is there much we can do from here? Let's see. Let's uh, let's take a moment and just think. Um, so that's nice. So, like, right away we can drop that. Let's wear this. And then this guy right here. Uh, entity damage. Almost eight. And then this guy. Entity damage. A little over eight and a half. So that's, that's good. Uh, let's see. You can probably make more arrows, yeah? Because I'm going to need a bajillion of them. And the better I get off arrow tech, the better. The sooner I get it off, the better. Uh, let's see. Is there st really stuff to loot? Adrian, found your favorite thing. All right. So let's... We will take just a moment, guys. Um, some people like to use these. Oh, someone's getting wrecked. I can barely hear it. Some people like to use those wooden chairs as... Who puts a forge here as park hour obstacles? I just use them for fuel. Oh, we found the forge. So that's good, I guess. Right? Can I pick these up? No. So we found all of the crafting stations. Uh, but not a whole lot to loot, unfortunately. Alright, let's get in here. A little bit of food, because, I mean, even at this super early game stage, things like cans uh, can be very, very valuable. Those bottles are fantastic, that's excellent. So, so far, cook pot. Oh my gosh. Uh, I'm liking this start much more than the last game. So we'll hang out and we'll play this newer build as much as we can. Uh, and then I think from this playthrough, we're going to continue uh, our cumulative experience. Um, basically, guys, this is the start of the Let's Play. Um, we didn't get very far in the last build, so I'm not going to worry about it. But this playthrough going forward this is our official let's play this is the one where we're gonna build nine bases and make z nation super proud and we're gonna have a kill count of like 5,000 we're not gonna run off this ledge you guys should be very proud of me there and a freaking cave now that right there folks is what I was looking for that is awesome so so far pretty good seed eh is this guy just gonna stand there and take it I think so. Wait, there's another one. Oh, you sneaky, sneaky people. Rah, 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 rah. I don't do a very good impression of that. Oof. One moment, folks. Makes you almost feel bad for the zombies, doesn't it? Almost, but not quite. And then they just chill out. It's just, you know, kind of interesting to watch the, the AI do its thing. All right. Uh, what... A seed, guys. What a seed. Anything else worth... Oh, that's kind of a cool area right there. One terrace, two terrace, three terrace? Hmm. I think a big aspect to doing big awesome builds, right? Uh, well, there are... I, first off, I think there are several. Um, you know, the first one, and arguably to me the most important, is you need to be able to see... The landscape and then figure out how you're going to use it oh i don't want to go out here guys um once you do that 
I think the next big thing to consider is that I don't want to go out here and face the wolves. Uh, you need to be tactically on point, which means once you see an area to build a base, your design needs to be functional, right? <sighs> what a jerk. That right in the bottom. Right in the bottom again. I don't know how that missed. Eat arrow, puppy. With my last arrow. Okay. Um, we'll do our best to get this wolf. Uh, no promises, <laughs> as you can imagine. I'm sure we're going to get picked up. We're going to wind up just sprinting. So, yep. Though the knife sure does help a lot, right? Okay, uh, let's see. Let's make our way. So we got to watch out for snakes now, which is just terrifying to me. Um, let's... Okay. Oof, okay. Um, so we're going to watch out for snakes. We're going to watch out for feathers. And, of course, the golden rod. Oof. And as you guys can tell, we will make our way over here. Look at the big clump of rocks. That's cool. Oh, gosh. I hear it. Ooh, bird's nest. I'm sure there's no way this will backfire. And, of course, scary zombie lumberjack, which I don't see nearby. I love how big and deep the water is now. It's almost like we don't have lakes. We have, like, these big, deep... I saw something move over here. Uh, these big, deep canyons carved um, into the landscape. I mean, I really like it. And now, I was actually not going to do any farming, but because, but because uh, it gives us XP, I'm pretty much going to have to. Yep. All right. That kind of shooting, and especially that kind of shooting. Ah. I got cacti'd. Good experience, folks. Very good experience. And then maybe we'll get lucky with some loot. All right. He didn't need that arm. Take that, grass. I just want this guy to die. I really don't think that's unreasonable. Oh man, love that ragdoll physics and a good drop too. All right. Um. Wait, what? Oh great. Um, that one way up there. Where's that lumberjack? Oh hoodie. So remember, folks, you really don't want to be downhill. You really want to be uphill. Um, we're gonna save this and hopefully this guy gives us a better reach. Um. So let's real quick sprint up and around. So we're uphill, right? See, I recall that being close enough. I think they tightened it up. I think that's what they did. So we're just going to have to recalibrate again. Ah, okay. There we go, guys. Uh, this actually is not a bad staging area. 
because I, I don't even know if that's Hub City. Like, it, it might be. I have no idea. Um, I do know, though, that, like, it's 3 o'clock. And I still don't actually know what I'm going to do. Um, let's get to it. Let's see if it's Hub, and we'll figure it out from there. Good old nice cold slog. I think that right there in the middle of my crosshairs, now just above it before the shrubbage, the shrubbery popped in, I think that was a duffel bag. So we will pop on over there and see. Uh, duffel bags, purses, backpacks, of course, and that dang vulture right there. Um, all good things. How are we looking on arrows? What are we missing? Feathers. Yeah. And I'm sure I'm missing just tons of bags. Or I'm sorry, bags. Tons of feathers. Well, that's a cool little camp area. Awesome. Okay. I think that was just a stock. But the duct tape's a great find, too, for when I inevitably walk off something and break another wrinkle. Oh, hello, campsite. I'm sure there's no way just running in here and looting frantically. That's our first sleeper of the series, guys. Man, I do not like how close you have to get. And we got Rumber Jack over there. Oh, jeez Louise, that was close. Jerks. Didn't even get to loot all the stuff I wanted to. I love how there's this big depression there. That's awesome. Ah, here we go, folks. That right there. Um, it's a brick building we're familiar with. We know the layout, and we know that we can secure it. Um, so we're going to land on this beach here. We're going to secure a beachfront, and then we're going to march right up that path. And hopefully not get owned. And hopefully it's not Hub City, but like, guys, like, look at all this. Um, and it's not the house that we're going to stay at by any means, but it is the house that we're going to stay at for the night. But like that broken building right there makes me think that this might be Hub City. It was the only uh, building on the map, and I generated it out to three. Uh, you can generate it out one through five. As far as size, I didn't want to wait all day. So I didn't generate it out to five. I chose three as just kind of a middle ground. Um, and it was the only group of buildings I could find that had a skyscraper in it. And not that I have a build pertaining to the skyscraper, but I did want to, uh, you know, see what it was all about. So I'm hoping that that is exciting. And I don't know if you guys have noticed too, but I'm trying to be a little less risk averse here in my uh, play style. I think Alpha 15 S'more would have avoided the boar because we didn't know what it was all about. We wouldn't have tried to loot these things. We wouldn't have gone for the wolf. But Alpha 16 S'more, uh, we're going to try and take a little more risk. And let's see. We have no stamina. So, oh, come on, really? It's going to take like a million hits, right? Because we got no stamina here. Oh, man. Why am I so low on health, too? I didn't even notice that. Okay. I meant to grab the um, first aid pill because I don't like being this low on health. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Because that wasn't terrifying at all, and I have no bajillion ladders to get up here. Oh, this is not looking good, guys, and I have no arrows. And they're rapidly following us, and I'm going to run right into more of them, I'm sure. Why are they still following? That is insane. Okay, there's a Twitch guy. There is a freaking bear. Oh my god, you got to be kidding me. Okay, sorry for not talking a whole lot, guys. I am in, like, try-hard mode. I wish you could see my face, but I am not at all decent to be putting on camera at the moment. Uh, 
Uh. Yep. Very, very close. I hear it. <laughs> rawr, rawr, rawr. Freaking wolf. Well, guys, this worked once upon a time. Look at the size of that thing. That thing is very large, and that lady is very angry. Can I not make freaking wood frames? And can they hit me up here? Well, yes. I mean, really, they probably could. Um, I need... Oh, I know what I need, folks. That poor guy. We beat the bejesus out of him. He's still going. Oh, I don't have any wood either. Why do you guys even watch? You guys know what's going to happen. Watch out for the tryhard. I feel like we can just cue the, like the circus music, the Benny something or other. I want to call it a Benny Haha's, but I think that's actually a restaurant. How will know after he makes fun of me in the comment section below. All right, friends. So I can get into a safer area, but I cannot actually get, um, All right. Oh, did you hear that? That was so cool sounding. I bet I don't actually know what it was, but like... Okay. So now all we... I don't know that they're going to give... Oh my gosh. Did you know what they're going to do, guys? They're going to go right through that building. Oh man, I'm about to get like my face eaten. Let's just... I, I don't want to see what they do. Plus, I'm going to need like more wooden frames. Can I make more wooden frames? I can make a few more. Which is good. We're going to need those. We're also going to need... Uh, and then, have we made all the arrows that we can make? I think so. Oh, man. Better shoot better than that. And that was apparently enough to ding. I will be bringing a hut up too, guys. It's just, um... It's just going to take... Uh, or I would like to get to, um... Let's see. I would like to get to, um... You know, to where we are at the actual release. The official release. Um, I want that just because I think I'm going to need the extra health. Not always the best reason, but it's going to have to work for now. Should get us, provided I'm very careful, this should get us to the top, right? And then the one thing we gotta watch out for up here is any more sleepers. Oh, guys. <laughs> oh, freaking dire wolf. No more arrows. No sleepers up here either, though, which is nice. Unless they spawn in. I have been noticing seeing a severe amount of spawn in. Um, so just keep that in mind in your own games. Let's see. Since I've had to start and restop uh, several different times, I'm not actually sure how long 
This is running, so um, we can probably min-max this, right? Let's wear that, scrap that. Do we want to wear this? Um, I don't think so. Let's scrap that for now. Let's eat that. Um, let's see, we can get some simple stuff set up, right? And I'm really hoping that that stuff just dies down. Um, I think we're safe with the frame there. That was just a stock, unfortunately. Okay, we've got that worn. Kind of worried about light, but I think if it's tucked there in the corner, we should be okay. Yeah? I'm sorry, Adrian, buddy, but those are going to go up there for now. And then, of course, we are just emptying out our inventory, really. What I need now are just a whole bunch of ladders. Um, right, to make getting in and out of here much easier, but I also kind of want everything to die down outside. Not sure if it's going to or not. Let's see. Is any of this stuff... So, like, this is all insulative, right? It's going to increase our heat. Um, and we're holding steady right now. That's good. Uh, let's see. Honestly, guys, for right now, this is probably as good as it's going to get. Can we make... Oh, we can. Worth it. If you scrap, what do you scrap into? I think it's just a clock fragment. Do I want to wear you? No, I do not. Excellent, guys. Just more bandages. And I don't think I have enough for the bedroll. I need a few more, because a bedroll here would be nice, too. Uh, let's see. We can't skill up weapons until level 5, and I think we're, like, level 2? 3? Let's take a peek, shall we? Oh, level two, right? Ah, okay, folks. Um, you notice I'm stalling again, right? Because I don't want to go back out there. <laughs> I don't have wood to make a storage chest either. Um, and man, these guys are just savage. All the good stuff I don't want to lose in case I do something stupid. Okay, everything else should be all right. Uh, these we need to fill. Um, so let's see, it's 7.30. Uh, we're going to need to hack away enough that we can make some ladders. And they are very, very close to us. Okay. Well, that wasn't terrifying at all, folks. No, not at all. Not with a dire wolf. Not with, you know... Oh, man. The bear there. Oof. So this is for the bed frame. Those guys. They are just wicked. Uh, this is for the ladders, guys. Which I probably should really be focusing on first. Um, I hope if I run this way, I don't pull anything else, but that's a definite chance. Oh, that is not nearly enough. I know, so angry. And I'm sure we have some behind us. You know, normally that they would have lost interest, guys. I swear I didn't put them on feral. Because I am not tough enough to do that. And this poor guy right here. Look at that poor Schlemiel. Alright, we dropped this guy. More of that stuff. That's good. I'm thinking probably closer to 15. Um, let's get... Come on, fill. Okay. I know. Much anger. That's going to have to be enough, guys. Oof. Let me tell you guys, very, very stressful first day. <laughs> I don't even know how some of my better looking counterparts did this. <sighs> oh, 
Of course, right? <laughs> Just one short. Um, if I scrap that, that's three. We can craft that. That gives us one more. And we're going to be so very careful as to not fall down and die. And we're going to be hunted for forever, but that's okay. Uh, let's see. We have enough for recipe. Uh, you know, guys, overall, not a bad start. Um, I'm not going to brag about it, but it's not bad. Um, I could have made more wood for a storage chest. See? Like that right there. Look at that baloney. Okay, apparently she's dead. Okay. Woo. Oh, what is this right here? This is like the very worst one, too. I hate this one. So I have no idea if they're going to continue to spawn up here. Um, I really hope not. Like, do we have to throw the torch down? I don't know. I kind of feel like that calls more attention, right? But there's a torch for whatever that matters. Uh, it's getting late, guys. I think we're going to call the episode here. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you did enjoy the episode. If you did enjoy the episode, please make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that good jazz. My goal is to get to 1,000 subs during Alpha 16. And if you do enjoy the comment, you know, maybe consider subbing. Don't worry about it if you didn't enjoy it. Though if you didn't enjoy it, I don't know why you are still watching this late into the video. I don't, don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next episode. Thank you for watching Like, comment, share, subscribe for more.